So here's the truth. There are some bits about motorhome life that they just don't tell you about. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is what happens when it breaks down. This is not a good situation to be in. So for two days, we have been sat in the same location. Um, wild camping at its absolute finest, I would suggest. Um, yeah, stress. It's just been absolutely awful. So what happened? We were driving down to family and we got uh, about three quarters of the way there, thought we'll stop and get some fuel. Stop to get fuel, power cut out of the motorhome. All my life, nothing. So what happens? Well, we have to pull in. Nothing, we started. We, um, we got jump started, sorry. And then we continued our journey. Um, and then it just, the Blackpool illuminations lit up on the dash and it was awful. Luckily, we pulled in and we were in a safe location, uh, yeah, next to the main road. Anyway, cut a long story short, too big for recovery because we are over three and a half tonne. So, alternator's gone. What do we do? Bank holiday weekend. Nobody to rescue us. What are we going to do? Have us no idea. So, Start ringing around, mobile mechanics, can anyone come? Ah, oh, problem is, mate, you can't get a new alternator at this short notice. What do you do? So, we rang up, we obviously had to wait as well till the garage, because we've only had this a couple of days, right? So, as of recording this, we've had it three days at the Moho. Um, and so we had to record, wait for the garage, to, for the garage where we bought it from to open up, so we can get some advice from them. Um, Spinney's have done an amazing job again. They've really, really done well. They've turned around and said, no matter the cost, get it sorted, we'll, we'll pay for it, which is, thank you, Spinney's. You've, you've, you've made us very happy. Well, we're on route to family, right? Wife's been picked up by her sister, which is great. So Janine's gone. It's just me and Judo, a greyhound. And I'm sat here on my own thinking, this is it, isn't it? This is, this is the truth about living in a motorhome. This is the truth that you just don't get to see on the internet, that shit goes wrong. And when shit goes wrong, it goes wrong. However, would I change my mind about moving into a motorhome? Hell no. Hell no. i got a friend as well, DC Lomas. DC Lomas is the garage you need to go for for everything because that guy cuts no corners. He is absolutely on Point. So, big shout out to DC Nomas because when we when we were scuppered, I rang him and said, oh, what do we do? It's just sorted everything for me. Everything. He's organised the tow truck. He's organised the repairs. He's organised everything. And he'd do that for anybody because that's the kind of guy he is. And, you know, he prides himself on the quality of his work and they go that much further. You can't you can't knock that and wherever you are in the uk dc low mass is worth traveling to to get sorted because this is the kind of service you get so what next well we're here for another 24 hours but well no, i get picked up in the morning actually so we wait i'll put some photos now about the uh where we are have a look So, day two of being sat in a lay-by. Well, not a lay-by, actually. It's pretty cool. Um, but main roads, traffic, Bertha. Still sat here outside a very nice place. But this is the thing they don't tell you, isn't it? We're awaiting recovery now, and the recovery truck should be here any minute. Um, and it's not been fun, guys. Sat at the side of the road. However, mindset is everything. So... We're all about keeping the mindset on point, and that's what it's all about. 
um, yeah, so I'm getting some funny looks now because I've been here a couple of days, just awaiting to go. Uh, yeah, but we'll be out of here today. Yay! Tow truck's coming. I'll keep you informed, guys. Keep you in the know of what's going on. But as a start to Moho life, it's been interesting. Um, girls are en route back up north. It's just little old me keeping a video diary, video log. Um, fingers crossed. Picked up soon. Yay! Instructions have been given. Um, RS amazingness are en route. Should be coming up this hill any second. And we should be getting picked up finally. Um, fingers crossed to be here in a minute. There she is. And there's the dual carriageway we've had to park next to. It has been rough sleeping there. Although, she has done bloody well because she's soundproof to death and I've slept like a, like a beast. So happy days. So we wait um, and then we'll get the recovery and we'll be gone. This is real motorhome life, guys and girls. Real motorhome life. As we said, real life, getting dragged on. Here we go. So that's it guys, all loaded up, ready to go. 122 miles till we get to DC low mass. Um, and then that, that legend's gonna put us a new alternator on. Well, so yeah, really, really cool. RS recovery's done as a right sound here. Um, properly professional. The guys picked me up as an absolute legend. Um, yeah, well happy. So thank you very much RS. Uh, and here we go, speak to the other side. Cheers guys. So we're here, RS Recovery has nailed it. Absolutely diamond, absolutely diamond. Here at DC Lomas, guys, I cannot tell you how incredible the service is from these guys at DC Lomas. Just Google them, get your vehicle here. They go above and beyond, above and beyond. You know what I mean? And uh, RS Recovery, what? These boys, pinnacle of professionalism that's all I'm gonna say they have bought the lovely Bertha machine all the way here not once very much brand new to us not once have I even worried been hesitant panicked nothing it's been perfect from start to finish that's enough said anyway got to get her off get her in there massive shout out to spinnies as well because they've done what they said they'd do um, and they're gonna fund this they're gonna sort it out they're gonna cover the cost um, and that's incredible you don't really get service like that nowadays guys so yeah really happy um, and this young gent here has been nothing but an absolute superstar from start to finish and uh, yeah he, need, he needs a pay rise that's all I'm saying he needs a pay rise this guy definitely needs a pay rise he's awesome so yeah happy days guys happy days So here we are guys, after a night spent in uh, DC Lomas's garage, um, just waking up, all the admin is done, moho life, Bertha's getting fixed today, oh my life, I can't tell you what this has been like, there's no real words, I mean Janine's had to go and stay at my mum's with the dogs, um, yeah, it's been quite an emotional few days of sitting in a car park, you know, sitting in a lay-by, dealing with that, and then dealing with the fact that we had no alternator, because that's what's happened, the alternator's gone, dealing with all sorts, 
but I can't believe how good Dean from DC Lomas has been. It's incredible. He's literally blown it out of the park by not only organising everything, because he goes above and beyond, and he would do for you guys as well. I'm nobody special. But the fact that, you know, he's catered. He's properly gone out his way to make sure that we're happy. He's, you know, given us somewhere to park up. Allowed us to have an electrical hookup. It's crazy. So, we now wait for the garage to open. Um, I'll give you a quick snapshot of where we are. Actually in the garage, which is... So, wait for it to open, get her fixed, drive back home. Um, we've got the wife. Fun and games, yeah? Fun and games. Yeah, moho life, it is what it is. So that's it, ladies and gentlemen. We are done. Uh, everything's fixed, everything's done. <sighs> Genuinely, these guys, DC low mass. I've said it 100 times in this video, haven't I? But they rock, they absolutely rock. Full services, the lads are absolutely on point. So happy. Um, they've done a full fit for me, they've tested the battery. Battery's good to go, done everything, and there she is, good to go. So, now it's just a jump in, journey back home. Well, I say home, that is home, isn't it? So it's just getting it, get gone, all good. Right, brilliant, let's do this. Yes! <laughs>